Item. SCP-1028. Object Class. Safe. Special Containment Procedures. Instances of SCP-1028 are to be kept in a large free-flight aviary. When needed, the feeders are to be filled with seed and berries. Once a week, the insect, earthworm, and snail population of the aviary should be checked, with more being introduced as needed. Care is to be taken to ensure that all specimens remain fairly calm, and any flora species or variety not accounted for in the building of the aviary is to be removed and incinerated, as per Addendum 01. Wild instances should be caught or killed. Standard traps used for the capture of similarly sized birds are suggested. Live captured specimens are to be transported individually and released into the aviary. Killed instances should be preserved and brought to the lab at site for dissection by staff researchers. Description. SCP-1028 is a previously unknown species of passerine, songbirds, with some aspects of physiology, size, and genetics pointing towards an inclusion in family sternity, starlings. All discovered instances have had brilliant iridescent plumage. There is no uniformity to the color of the individual instances, leading some to suspect that SCP-1028 is actually several subspecies, each with a different dominating color. No sexual dimorphism has been observed in the species. Instances of SCP-1028 produce the usual complement of songs, calls, and vocalizations usual to their order. Most calls produced by specimens have no effect on other animals, and many humans find them pleasant to hear. The unusual properties of SCP-1028 appear strongest when a large flock are observed flying. When a flock of 25 or more instances are flying together, the flock appears to scintillate, creating a dazzling effect on observers. This dazzling effect is not limited to human observers, as dogs, cats, foxes, and other predators have been observed to act in a stunned manner when passed by a large enough flock. The sharp, high-pitched mobbing call produced by instances has a similar effect to the flocking. It not only calls more instances to the area, but also induces a dazed effect in predatory species. Affected individuals claim to have observed flashes of light punctuating each call. Those affected by either form of dazing enter a state of altered perception, lasting for a length of time proportional to the time spent viewing or hearing instances. The existence of SCP-1028 was brought to the attention of the Foundation when a large traffic accident occurred in, which resulted in casualties, and hospitalizations. None of the witnesses saw the accident, but all reported seeing a multicolored flock of birds.